Life on Earth would not be possible without the Moon, it keeps our planet's axis of rotation stable, which controls seasons and regulates our climate. However, there has been considerable debate over how the Moon was formed. The popular hypothesis contends that the Moon was formed by a Mars-sized body colliding with Earth's upper crust which is poor in metals. But new research suggests the Moon's subsurface is more metal-rich than previously thought, providing new insights that could challenge our understanding of that process. Today, a study published in Earth and Planetary Science Letters sheds new light on the composition of the dust found at the bottom of the Moon's craters. Led by S. Am Hege, research scientist of electrical and computer engineering at the USC Viterbi School of Engineering, and co-investigator of the MINI-RF instrument on board NASA Lunar Reconnaissance Orbiter LRO, the team members of the Miniature Radio Frequency MINI-RF instrument on the Lunar. The researchers concluded that the Moon's subsurface may be richer in metals i.e., Fe and T oxides than scientists had believed. According to the researchers, the fine dust at the bottom of the Moon's craters is actually ejected materials forced up from below the Moon's surface during meteor impacts. When comparing the metal content at the bottom of larger and deeper craters to that of the smaller and shallower ones, the team found higher metal concentrations in the deeper craters. What does a change in recorded metal presence in the subsurface have to do with our understanding of the Moon? Thanks for watching. Do you like my video? Then show me your love by pressing like button. Please subscribe my channel and hit bell icon for new technology updates. Bye bye.